Hello everyone. In this demo we're going to go over how to implement the Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011 uh, membership management implementation by Planet Technologies along with the sample data for the purposes of generating a demo. Uh, this is to be used by Microsoft employees or other partners uh, in the you know realm of association and nonprofit management and also to be able to generate very quickly a CRM online organization and build a demo uh, based upon the Planet Technologies solution. So with that I've got a Microsoft CRM online organization ready to go. I'm going to launch my organization. Okay. Here is my brand new CRM 2011 online org. First things first I'm going to come down here to settings, data management, sample data and remove the default sample data. Now this is going to take some time to process and while that's processing we're going to go ahead and import our solution. Let's close that. Come over here to solutions. We're going to go ahead and click import. Click browse. Navigate to the folder where you stored everything. So this should be on your desktop or wherever you would put it. I'm going to go down here to the managed solution. I have both managed and unmanaged, but for this implementation we're only going to show the managed solution. Activate any SDK processes. Press next. And then this should import. Okay. Import was successful of membership management. You can review everything that was imported as part of this. It's basically a number of different entities. Uh, some charting and a couple of web resources. Once that is done, we're going to go ahead and select this and publish all the customizations. Once that's done, we can refresh by pressing F5 or selecting refresh all the way at the top. Since we changed the sitemap, we need to do that F5 to get everything back to the way it should be. Now we have our dashboard that has no data in it as of yet. Come down here to imports we need to get some data into the system. So we're going to go to import data. And here we're going to browse to the zip file called uh, data imports.zip. Now the nice thing about this is a nice little hidden feature inside of uh, CRM 2011 that allows us to import multiple different types of data from a zip file. So we're taking use of that. We're going to do the default automatic map. Notice we get all the checkboxes. We're importing candidates, companies, family members, members, and membership materials associated with all of them. We're not going to allow any duplicates. Granted, it doesn't necessarily matter. We don't really have any in the system. And you can select who the owner is going to be. Press Submit. Once it's been created, it puts it in the submitted queue. And if you notice now, we've got all these different imports that are running. So you can continue to click the refresh button until all the import is done. And this will actually take care of all the relationships between all the different data types as well, which is really nice. So they're going to move from parsing to transforming, etc. within the system. So we're just going to wait for a moment until these complete. Okay, now that I've got my completed imports, so I've got the 10 company records, 10 family members, 10 members, eight membership records and 49 candidates. Now if I go back to my dashboard, magically all of my data appears. So with that one import file we're able to actually import all of the different data types whether it be members, membership levels, uh, the family members information that we had, all the join information, uh, everything that we had inside of the system now automatically comes, comes through and here we can review all the data and it also does the recursive relationships between uh, the primary member to a company or a member and their parent company. So all this information is automatically imported. We've got a number of different candidates that come through into the system as well. Uh, they are ready to be converted so if there's any other data points that you wanted to add in you certainly could do so. On our members Everything should be customized, including the form and our dialogues to fill out all the data. So the member details, they already have all their membership level pieces of information filled out. 
uh, family members have been added to the system, etc. And this is all done with just a few clicks. So I hope you all can enjoy this. Uh, don't forget to upload uh, any associated images that you have for these individuals. Uh, so we have a Silverlight solution here, uh, or you can use your webcam to basically take a picture and add that to any of the different members. This is great for adding a little pizzazz to your demos uh, and associated information. Okay. Well, happy demoing and take care.